Hey, what's up? I'm Derek Kirk of Effectatron, and today uh, Kit Bash just announced their winners for the big Secrets of the Luminari Challenge. I've been uh, promoting that as well, and I also just love Kit Bash. I love seeing what people make and men as well. So we're going to do uh, a look at these first place winners across the three categories, gaming, concept, and, and motion. First off, in gaming, we've got uh, this, which is Jose Scar. And I mean, the fact that you can just make a game in Unreal Engine inside of Fortnite is insane to me because it's amazing. So you can bring in these assets and just make a game like that's so cool. Like if, if this was something that was available, you know, 20 years ago when I was like 10 or 12, like they're, they're going to be kids that are just making insane things by the time they're our age, man, it's going to be wild. Look how awesome that is. That's so sick. Okay, cool. So next, the concept art. Oh my gosh, this one. I saw this one in the Discord. It is so cool. Boom. Boom. Look at this. Very, very cool. Love the idea. In motion. These are nuts. We'll watch the entire reel. They put it all together, but just look how cool this is. And I'll link this below as well, but tuk tuk tango like this is just oh man the crash sim i mean there's got multiple people working on this but like it's nice like that is so good let's take a look at the winner's highlights montage and we're just gonna talk about it while, while we're going through it uh, and i've seen a lot of these through the uh discord and i'm gonna talk over them just for the sake of um like tag like uh copyrights and stuff i don't know what music people i'm sure kipa she's copyright approved music but i don't know if i have the copyright to that so look at that she looks like the girl from uh, stranger things the one that works at the ice cream store with steve harrington that's wild so good so i saw the guy that was making that one not this one but this scene like that he made like the flag and all that stuff like that's a blender plugin apparently that he used and it's just like man this is just goofy i love it look at these car physics though this must be on an engine thing like these nice car rigs and stuff but like that that like these are things that like i Just things that I, I gotta turn it down. These are things that I like. I just can't see myself making in Cinema 40. Like some of the effects and stuff, but like that's probably Niagara, if not Jenga. Oh, good audio effect on this part too. But that's pretty. S People have been searching this mountain for decades. Oh. But none of them have looked inside the mountain. What does that mean? It means I hope you brought some dynamite. Look at that. Oh my gosh. It's so good, dude. Yes. I mean, like, oh my god. Okay, stuff like this, like characters and stuff like that. Oh my gosh. They're so good. That was awesome. Sick. Oh, just like <laughs> Oh, what a cool idea. Oh my gosh. Nice, dude. <laughs> I would love to go through and see what of that, what of that was C4D, what of that was Blender, what of that was Unreal Engine. Cause you know, like a ton of the, a ton of it has to be Unreal Engine. Like it's so cool. This one's amazing. I think I saw this one on the Discord, and I think it's Blender. Um, that's a such a cool idea. Like this is the little ship. The blimp is this, and then they add on this extra bit to give it like that future punk kind of five. Ooh, that's cool. Like, I just want to talk to these people about what they did to make it. It's wild. Like, this is a completely free assets. And this is, like, 
they obviously they're entering to win a contest, right? But it's just amazing how talented people are out there. And it's just like, I mean, I, I made my little render image and, you know, I spent a day on it and that was it. And I moved on. That's what I do with a lot of stuff. But then I see some of this stuff and I'm like, okay. And, and part of it's because I know like in Cinema 4D, like I'm not going to spend weeks rendering it out. And so they have tutorials and stuff, which is really cool. Um, how cool this stuff is. So it's like, but I know with, I use Unreal Engine, I can make an animation. I can drive a car through a jungle and do like six different shots of it going through the jungle. And I can render it out overnight in like one night. And in C40, that's just not possible. So it's like, it's just, and you know, I don't know where you are in your journey. Um, but when I see stuff like this, like this is what I want to do. I want to make these epic scenes epic. <laughs> Hashtag ad for Unreal. No, but these like epic scenes, these characters are from big, medium, small. I recognize them. Like that's a really cool scene. Gosh, it's so cool. I have no idea what's going on here. I want to look at all of them. Um, so great work, every body. I mean, that's just inspirational. And even if you didn't win or didn't enter or whatever, it's cool just to see what people can do, man. I love it. Uh, so yeah, that's just my reactions to it. I thought it'd be fun to do a reaction video and talk about it. And, and uh, let's just, you know, I'm inside Unreal Engine right now. How about that?